Hi, this is Gareth Brown from Rich Games for Learning. I'm going to show you a simple addition game which I've come up with using a dice. It's called Add Rows, and players need to roll the dice, put the numbers in the circles until they can circle a row of numbers which equal a target number that they come up with. So it's for younger students uh, in about grades 1, even kinder or grade 2 who are looking at addition. So I'll show you how to play. Now the aim of the game for add rows is to circle as many combinations of numbers that equal the target number that you can. And the winner is going to be the player who circled the most. The first thing you need to do is come up with a target number. Um, it's good to use a target number between about 15 and 40 if you're using a 10 sided dice. If you're using a bigger dice then you can have a, a larger number. Okay, we're going to play and equal the target number 20. So then players take turns rolling the die. And orange has rolled a 1, so they pick any of the circles and put a 1 in it. So then green's turn, and they're going to pick, or they've rolled an 8, so they can put an 8 there. Now both players have rolled a few times and put numbers in different circles and the orange player has just rolled a 7. And if you look here you can see we've got a row of numbers. 8 plus 4 equals 12 plus 1 equals 13. So if we add the 7 and we can write the 7 there. 7 plus 1 plus 8 plus 4 equals 20. Because that's our target number, we can circle that row. Now players can circle rows of numbers vertically like this, horizontally, and also diagonally in any direction. If a number is part of a row, for example, orange circled this row which 8 is a part of, it can still be added to other numbers in a different row. So green has just rolled a 2, and in a row here we have 5 plus 1 which is 6, plus 4 which is 10, plus 8 which is 18. So green can put the 2 there, so 18 plus 2 equals 20, and then they can group that whole diagonal row together, because all the numbers added together equal the target number 20. And the game finishes when all the numbers have been taken up into all the circles. The winner is the player who has the most combinations that equal the target number. So in this case, green has one, two, three, four, five combinations, and orange only has one, two, so green would be the winner. Now if you have a look at this for a bit longer, you'll probably find some more combinations uh, or rows of numbers that equal 20 that I have missed. Well, thank you for watching. That is a free download, and the download link should be uh, just below this video. Also, if you've got anything you'd like to add, then please leave a comment and share this online as well. Thank you.